guys, this is Tara with Kittens, Weights, and Tarot, and I'm bringing you a deck review of the Tarot in Space deck. So this is a deck that I purchased off of Etsy. Um, definitely go check it out. Um, but it just came in this neat little like moon and stars bag. Um, and then let's uh, look inside here. Okay, um, there we are. There's my top cards. Uh, so Tarot in Space, Art and Concept by Laura L.E.D. Douglas, uh, the L.E.D. Animation.com. So if you are interested in this deck, uh, you can definitely go down here. Um, but that's up to you. This video is merely because I think the images look pretty rad. They remind me um, of uh, Futurama. <laughs> kind of like the characters from Futurama. Kind of like, you know, like that. So, um, so yeah. We'll jump into it. There is a guidebook that goes with it, but it's a downloadable uh, PDF. And then there was a nice little thank you for purchasing the deck. Um, okay, so let me put these off to the side. And let's take a look at the cardstock first. Okay, so you have this cool like little simple stars pattern um, very smooth, very smooth finish, um, almost like satin, <laughs> um, and it's pretty flexible, got kind of a sheen to it, but not too much, um, and it is your, uh, standard tarot size. So yeah, there you go. And let's take a look at the cards now. Um, I have already used this deck and I've used it quite often since I got it um, maybe five or six months ago. Um, so they are out of order and I will show all the cards. So if you're one to be surprised, uh, then you don't have to look at all of them. But um, if you're just merely here for the art, then look away. Or uh, I mean, <laughs> well, look away as in look on, look on. <laughs> look at the arts. <laughs> okay. Um, so some of these have been renamed, um, and I believe that like rockets is wands, uh, lasers is swords, um, saucers is cups, and planets is pentacles. Okay. So like I said, the characters have kind of a Futurama art feel to them. I don't know, like a like a cross between Futurama and um, in the late '80s, or early '90s Saturday morning cartoons, like that type of color scheme, type of feel. Um, working with the deck, however, is not fluffy bunny. <laughs> it's definitely not Saturday morning cartoons when I'm working with it. Um, for me, as kind of fun as it looks. Uh, this has been a very um, hard-hitting deck. <laughs> like when you're like, oh, like I'll just do a little reading on this, and then it like slaps you in the face with like some stuff that you weren't thinking it was looking at, and then you're like, oh, I forgot all about that stuff. <laughs> so yeah, um, doesn't doesn't shy away from stuff you don't want to hear. <laughs> So I will say that I don't work with the deck of that often, not because I'm running away from things I don't want to hear, but sometimes I don't need people beating me over the head like every single reading that I do. <laughs> Just like I don't want to hang out with friends that are like that like all the time. So um, when I really need to hear some hard truths or um, like it's a very serious reading about something that's really serious going on in my life, um, then I will bust this deck out. I've used it for readings with my friends, but not necessarily readings with clients. I usually have, like if I'm doing like a face-to-face -face reading uh, here in San Diego, I usually bring a few decks with me, and this one doesn't really get chosen that often. I do love the Empress card because she kind of looks like Alien Beyonce. Defender. That's so awesome. Sorry, just making sure the lighting's good for you guys. 
I like that one. The two of Wands. The Hound. Yeah, so those of you that are just like merely into art, I would think that they would love watching uh, tarot videos, oracle videos, live paintings, you know, just, um, you know, it's like just, it's 78 pieces of art that are in my hand and I love looking at images. I've said in videos before that I like images so much, I cut out images from magazines and I keep them all in a, um, binder. Is it because I want to buy all those things that, you know, I saw? I mean, if life had dealt me like a bazillion jillion dollars maybe I would buy those things but uh, for the most part I just like to look at them so an image of them for the most part is good enough for me oh. Mulder and Scully that's gotta be Mulder and Scully <laughs> you got judgment you guys know the X-Files <laughs> Um, and this was a deck I was waiting to get created to come out, um, cause I had bought, uh, the Dame Darcy and there was a card within the Dame Darcy about one of the artists and she's like, I'm going to be creating this deck. And so I waited, I think like a year and a half or two uh, for her to create this deck. So it was nice to see it on, on Etsy. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and take all these cards and get them all put back together again so as you can see nice and smooth not too hard to get back and I'll give you guys a little bit of shuffle so you just can kind of see how that might go very smooth smooth like butter <laughs> um, and I'll lay three of them out just so you can see how they look aesthetically um, and I'm not posing a question at all but hey if you're watching this video and you want to make a question and do your own little reading that's fine with me okay now move this out the way okay so there you go um, we have the one of rockets king of rockets and four of saucers so again rockets are wands and saucers being cups so that's it from me spiritual homies uh, let me know if you own this deck or if you have questions about it if you have questions about the art or you just want to talk about how awesome and fantastic the art is or you know any of that um, I don't claim to be like an art you know expert <laughs> you know I didn't even take any you know art classes when I was in college I mean all I, I took art in high school and I took like some art outside of school but I'm by no means an expert I just know what I like and I think that um, this is pretty awesome so uh, yeah um, if you guys want to catch a reading with me and you want this deck specifically to use it for the reading you just need to let me know upon booking and yeah so uh, if you dug this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell for more videos just like this. And I'll catch you spiritual homies later. All right. Peace, love, and chicken grease. Peace out.